Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're coming across an issue on your Windows computer when you're trying to enter in your PIN or it says that the PIN isn't available and to set up your PIN once again. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here guys and without further ado, let's go ahead and just jump straight into it. So what we are going to start off this tutorial with is you want to open up File Explorer. So if you have a taskbar icon, go ahead and just open that up. Select this PC on the left side, just left click on it one time, and then double click on your local disk where Windows is installed on. Do the same thing now for the Windows folder. And now there should be a Service Profiles folder in here. Just scroll down, and you want to go double click on that. Should be a Local Service folder in here. Double click on that one as well. Select Continue if you need to gain permission to access this folder. And then you want to select App Data. If you don't see App Data in here, go ahead and select the View tab and then select Hidden Items. And now go ahead and double click on App Data. Double click on Local. And then double click on Microsoft. There should be an NGC folder in here. What you want to do is go ahead and right click on it. Select Rename and then add a .old on the end. So .old or period dot old just once you don't don't repeat it just have it exactly how you see it on my screen here hit enter you will need to have permissions in order to do that select yes and you also need folder permissions so click on next if you're coming across this message that you're unable to actually perform this action just click on close right click on the folder select properties then select security select the advanced button near the bottom here and then you want to select where it says change up at the top. Enter the object name to select. Go ahead and select the advanced button. And you want to go ahead and select your computer name here. So I have my MD Tech videos, so I'm going to go ahead and just double click on that. Now that I have that, now I'm going to go ahead and click on OK. Checkmark where it says replace owner or subcontainers and objects. Select apply. Select yes, OK, OK again, OK. Just close out all that stuff. And now we're going to try and rename this folder again. So right click on it, select rename, add a .old on the end, and it should save properly this time. And now you want to just close out of here and save out of any open programs and applications and just go and restart your computer. At this point too, if you went back to the login screen and you tried to select your PIN and were unable to, you could select I forgot my PIN. Try and walk through those steps as well. You might be able to have better luck with that at this point now that you have gone through this process. And now that we're back in the windows here, you're going to go ahead and open up the start menu. Select the setting gear icon on the left side where you hover over it, it says settings. So go ahead and left click on that. Select the Accounts tile, and then select the Sign In options on the left panel here. Select Windows Hello PIN, and then if you had this option available, you'd be able to go in here and set a PIN or reconfirm a PIN, basically. So pretty straightforward process there, guys. Again, like I said, I want to emphasize if you have an option to I forgot my PIN on like a link when you're signing in, you're welcome to go through that step as well. But this is just kind of providing another way around it as well. So pretty straightforward process, guys. I do hope that I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.